Good morning from the beautiful Caribbean island of Antigua. While I've been having a blast around this country so far, I'm heading now on a quick 24 hour trip to the tiny island next door called St. Kitts. I've decided to budget myself with exactly 100 bucks to see how much I could get. So let's go have some fun. The flight is only 25 minutes, just a hop, skip, and a jump from one turquoise beach to the next. Just arrived in St. Kitts, my 166th country. It is 1.15 p.m. and the clock starts now. 100 US dollars is 270 Eastern Caribbean dollars. So I tried to take a shared taxi to the city center, but the guy wanted 15 US. And then I saw it's only a 30 minute walk, so I said, screw it, I'm just gonna walk. It's hot and sticky outside, and I found the perfect relief. All right, I'll take one. I mean, not just stuffing up. Awesome. Thanks, man. <laughs> so refreshing. Finally, I reached my hotel in the center of town. The cheapest private room I found online was 50 US. And this is what I got. So, pretty basic, small, and really smells like cleaning stuff. I'm excited to explore the capital and biggest city of St. Kitts called Bastard. I have no idea what's happening here or what to do, but I'm just gonna walk around with my camera and try to show you guys some cool stuff. First things first, I'm hungry. Let's go. Hi, Hi. you have some local food? Yes. What do you have? We have fish. I think I'll go with the fish. Yeah, Oh, that looks really good. So that's gonna be 30 dollars. 30? Okay. Thank you so much. After eating, I headed out to explore the town. And there's not a whole lot to see here except for that Catholic church, which is pretty cool. But the country itself is quite unique. In terms of both population and land area, St. Kitts and Nevis is the smallest country in the Caribbean and all of the Americas. There's only 50,000 people in this country. I strolled down the main road to do a little bit of shopping. What's up, dude? <laughs> What's up? I love your page, man. Uh, Thanks, man. Some uh, nice videos about Sri Lanka. You're in my St. Kitts video now. Yeah. Excuse me. Yeah. Do you sell this flag? Yeah, yeah. For your car, your house. Come on, that. Thank you very much, man. Take it easy. I forgot to tell you guys how expensive the Caribbean is because they import everything and there's also a tax on top of that. But anything touristy is just insanely overpriced. I really want to go to Brimstone Hill Fortress, which is a UNESCO site, but the taxi quoted me at $80 round trip, and there's no buses that take me there, so unfortunately, I don't have the budget to go. But anyways, I'm going to go find some local food for dinner, then get some rest before exploring more of the town tomorrow. I walked into a random, semi-crowded restaurant, got myself a local plate of chicken and rice, and a Carib beer. The food was mediocre at best, and I actually had a hard time finishing it. Seven. I couldn't end the day without trying some local rum, the magical drink that's famous around the Caribbean islands. Okay, we can do punch, rum punch. Thank you so much. Good <sighs> morning, guys. It is 6 a.m. And I had a dream that I was playing golf. So I just Googled it, found a course nearby. I'm gonna walk over there and see what's going on. After some negotiations, I flew over here from Antigua just for a few days and I wasn't planning to play golf, but I was able to get range balls for 15 US and a free rental set. All right, I got my rental set, got the balls. Gonna spend about three hours here and practice. What I used to do in high school. If you ask me, there's no better way to spend the morning. I find golf to be therapeutic. I feel satisfied, got my golf fix in, and it's been a pretty good 24 hours here in St. Kitts. I hopped in a taxi van back to the airport and then grabbed a quick lunch before my flight out. In total, I got a roadside coconut, a hotel room, local fish lunch, a flag, chicken dinner, a carib beer, shot of rum, a morning on the golf range, a taxi ride, and an airport sandwich for $98.01. And that's how much fun you can have in St. Kitts with a hundred bucks in 24 hours. 